Hi guys, hope you're doing great. Welcome back to my channel. This is Ramya from Desi Girl 1010. Today's video is actually going to be yet another DIY project and I thought I should paint something and then I thought I should come up with something which is more easier and I am going to talk to you about the uh, idea I have in mind. Now I wanted to take a glass bowl or a glass container and paint it and then I thought hey let's not paint let's try something else. So this is a glass bowl I picked up from my local uh, Dollar Tree. You can buy any kind of shape, any kind of size that you want to try this on. And this has a base and it's rounded and it has this flower base kind of thing. And you can buy any paints that you want, any colors that you want to pick. I got four different colors just to try. There's a pink, there's an orange, there's a dark gray and a blue and I also have a basic black uh, lying around in the house. So I bought all of these four colors from uh, my local Walmart store for about 90 some cents each. You can also buy a pack of six colors uh, that you want to try. I wanted to pick specific colors so I just got these four. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pour each color and try to create a pattern in this. So I will show you what I'm going to do. So let's go ahead and get started. So taking the first color in, I want to take a darker base for my color. So this is the Apple Barrel Acrylic Paint in Admiral Blue. That's how the bottle looks like. I'm just going to go ahead and pour the color right in. Now if this product is a flop, you will not see this video. So this is more thicker. You can probably dilute it with some water. And I'm just going to basically tilt the glass so it creates different patterns. Now that created a pattern. Now I'm going to mix and match colors right here and there. So I'm going to go ahead with the brighter pink color. I'm sorry guys that the lighting is really bad. Let me switch to a different uh, location. Okay, now the lighting looks much better. Next is, I'm going to take a pink color. Now you can go ahead and create any patterns of your own choice. I'm going to go ahead and squeeze some right in there. And make sure I twist the ways again. Similar fashion. Now, you want to be slow in creating these patterns. So now the blue and pink mixes. And it's going to create its own pattern. And I basically just want to keep adding colors so I just get a pattern there. And um, yeah. I like the real, I really like the pink. And blue variations creating right here. So let's go ahead and twist and create um, the bowl just a little bit. Okay, as you can see that diverse print out on the outside. Doesn't it look beautiful? So next I'm taking this uh, gray color right here. And this is actually the Apple Barrel uh, Gloss Indoor. And the shade is dark gray. I'm going to mix that right here. And as you can see, it's the same simple routine. I'm just going to pour the color right in. Let's do this. I'm going to also mix the orange right here. And just go ahead and shake the bowl again. Or twist the bowl again. And I want to uh, create different colors, different patterns, just like this throughout the bowl. You can, uh, as I mentioned, you can use this with any kind of shape, any kind of size, ways. And I would, uh, I would highly recommend you to dry this bowl for about at least 24 to 48 hours. Because these paints are thicker in consistency and they will definitely need some kind of coating, some kind of dryness, some kind of glossy finish that you want to give. 
to the bowl and as you can see the inside also looks really beautiful let me show you a, a close-up that's how the inside looks like all right guys so here is the pattern here's the finished product and this is now a diy craft project that you can do with your kids that you can do as a gift to someone and or you can just do as an accent piece in your house so i hope you found this video helpful give this video a thumbs up and definitely subscribe and support my channel please and um yeah that's about it guys. Let this paint dry for about 48 hours and it's good to go. You can store this, uh, you can use this to store your makeup brushes, flowers, uh, whatnot, pens, you use it as a pen stand or whatnot. So that's how the product looks like and it's like a marbleized uh, finish, right? So all I did is just clean out the edges towards the top part and that's about it. So stay tuned, stay subscribed and I will talk to you guys very, very soon. Bye.